Hello guys, I hope you are doing really really well. Today I have with me JBL Tune Beam Earbuds and in this video I am going to show you how to use these earbuds with 15 tips and tricks. So let's start. The first tip is about how to connect these earbuds with your device. So first of all put these earbuds back into the charging case. So I will put them in the charging case and now open the Bluetooth settings on your device. So so here is the Bluetooth icon. I will press and hold it like this and then I will turn on the Bluetooth. Now what you have to do, you have to just close the charging case for two seconds and then open it again. So once you open it, here it will show you JBL Tune Beam and here it is giving you the option of connect. So you just select this connect option and then it will start making the connection. So you just have to wait for a few seconds. So now everything is done the JBL Tune Beam is now connected with my device. So you can just skip this Google option and here you can see it is connected from here. Now it is ready to use. The next tip is about JBL headphones app. So if you want to use all the features and functionalities for these earbuds, you have to download an app. So open the play store and then here you can search for the app. Name of the app is JBL headphones. So I will just write here JBL headphones and then I will start searching. So here you can see here is the app. So you just have to install it. So now the app is installed so I will open the app and here you have to make some settings to make a connection with these earbuds. So first of all you have to accept the terms and condition and then you have to allow nearby device permission and then allow it again. Then it will take just few seconds to make a connection with your device and then here you have to select this get started option and then you can set up your headphones later. So here is the later option so now the JBL tune beam is connected with the app with all the features and functionalities the first setting is about ambient sound control so open the JBL headphones app and then select the JBL tune beam so here you can see the very first setting is about ambient sound control so first of all you have to take out your earbuds from the charging case so I will take out these earbuds from charging case and once you take take it out you will see the ambient sound control will turn on automatically so here you can see now it is enabled now inside the ambient sound control you have three different options the first option is active noise cancellation so you can use noise cancelling to block out ambient noise the second option is ambient aware so if you want to hear what's going on around you you can use ambient aware the last option is talk through so you can use this option to have a quick chat with headphones on you can also use it to have a clear conversation the next setting is about equalizer so you can select this arrow and from here you can enable this equalizer option and here it is giving you six preset equalizer options so here you can select jazz vocal bass club studio or extreme bass you can customize your own eq as well select this plus icon and here you can set your own eq so here you can see I can easily adjust my own EQ. Once you finish you can use this save option and here you can see you have a new EQ available. The next setting is about controls. So here in the gesture section you can see the left earbud and the right earbud. For example I select this left earbud and here it will show you all the controls for the left earbud. For example if you single tap on the left earbud you can switch between noise cancellation and ambient aware you can also select this off option if you double tap it will switch to talk through and then you can use the tab and hold option to activate the native voice assistant you can also use the call control option for example if you have an incoming call you can just double tap to answer the call and if you want to hang up again double tap and it will hang up the call you can also reject the call by tap and hold you can also customize all of these controls for example here you can see we have this arrow just selected and you can switch between four different options you can use for volume control 
playback and voice assistant control or you can select the none option for example i select the volume control now here you can see it is now working as a volume control so if i single tap it will increase the volume if i double tap it will decrease the volume now let's talk about the right earbud so for the right earbud if you single tap it will play and pause the music if you double tap it will move to the next track if you triple tap it will go back to the previous track and then you can also set up a voice assistant if you select this setup voice assistant option here you can see you have three different options you can select google assistant amazon alexa or native voice assistant so currently i am using samsung device so it means it will activate the bixby you can also customize all these control for the right earbuds as well so here you can see this arrow just select it and here again it is giving you four different options the next setting is about voice aware so you can enable this option to control how much of your own voice you hear during calls so here you can change the intensity for example you can set it to medium or you can set it to high or you can set it to low the next setting is about smart audio and video so you can use this option for example if you select this audio mode it will give you best audio quality or you can switch to video mode it will improve the lip sync performance the next setting is about left and right sound balance so you can adjust the volume balance between left and right channels so here you can see you can easily set it manually by yourself so you can move to the extreme left or you can move to the right as well the next setting is about voice assistant if you select this arrow here it is giving you three different options you can select the google assistant amazon alexa or you can use the native voice assistant the next setting is about voice prompt language if you select this arrow here you see this option of language you can select this arrow and here it is giving you different options for the language so here you can select the french dutch italiano so different languages are available for voice prompt the next setting is max volume limiter so you can enable this option to set the volume below 85 decibels to protect your hearings and extend battery life the next setting is about find my birds so you can use this option to find lost earbud and it will play a high pitched beeping so for example for the left earbud if i play and then after three seconds if i select this continue option it will play a beep like this so now you can easily find out your lost earbud the next setting is about power saving if i select this arrow here it is giving me two different options the first option is auto standby you can enable this option and the headphones enter the standby mode if idle for 15 minutes to save power so in standby mode the anc will automatically be turned off the next option is auto power off if you enable this option here it is giving you three different time option so the headphones will automatically power off with idle mode lasting for 30 minutes you can select it for one hour or you can select it for two hours the next tip is about reset to factory settings just select this support option and here you can see the number four option is about reset to factory settings just select this arrow and here it is giving you two options if you want to reset or cancel so you can use this reset option if you want to reset your earbuds so it will take you out of the app and then your earbuds will completely hard reset the next tip is about how to power power of your earbuds so open the jbl headphones app and then here you see this power off button so just select it and here you can see it is giving you the power off option so you can use this option to power off your earbuds so guys this is for today's video please like this video and please subscribe to my channel thank you very much